Okay, so first of all, we are asked to find that they uh, to prove that they are congruent. Now, congruent means exactly the same lengths, exactly the same angles, exactly the same shape, so exactly the same thing. But you can rotate uh, with congruency. Okay, so the proofs are side, side, side. Well, we only have um, two of the sides. Now, theoretically, we could work out the other side by using Pythagoras' theorem, but we don't actually have to do that. So you could use side, side, side by using Pythagoras, working out the third side, and then working from there. Uh, the other one uh, is AAS, or ASA, which is angles, angle, side, angle, side, angle. Now, we're only given one angle, which is the 90 degrees, so we're not going to be using that one. Um, the other one is side, angle, side. Well, we have a side um, and an angle and another side, but the problem is the angle needs to be between the sides, and here the 90 degrees isn't between those two sides, so it's not going to be that one. The last one is RHS, right angle, hypotenuse, side. So let's have a look and see if we've got that one. Well, we've got the right angle. We've got the hypotenuse. And then we've got another uh, side. All three of those, obviously the right angle is the same, but all three of those are the same. So the right angle is uh, there, the hypotenuse is 12 meters, and then the other side is seven meters. So the proof that we use for this is just R, H, S.